Hola! Hi everybody! So I learned something new today. I guess it's a basic troubleshooting process that we normally do, but I don't know, sometimes I don't think right. <laughs> well, so what happened today was that I had a servo eye ventilator that the touch screen wasn't working properly, like the top wasn't recognizing the touch. <laughs> So um, I called the company and they're like, oh yes, uh, you cannot calibrate that. I was like, okay, uh, what's the solution? Then they're like, oh, just order a new touch screen. I was like, okay, how much is it? It was almost $4,000. So I was like, okay, uh, thank you. So we started like searching where to buy from. And a friend showed up, I'm not gonna mention who, and he's an expert on ventilators. He's like, oh, just, open uh, open the screen and remove the flex cable from the board connect it back in and that should fix your problem so i was like okay let me try that you know basic troubleshooting process but i don't know like i said sometimes i don't think that way <laughs> you know go back to the basics so here's what i did Our touch cream is working, yes! We saved almost $4,000, that's awesome. I know the company doesn't see that, but well, that makes me happy anyways. <laughs> Thank you for watching the video and I'll be posting more videos. Don't forget to subscribe, bye!